I wait for you while you have a poop. You can wait two seconds while I pick up your poop. Rant over, I guess. <laughs> Welcome to today's vlog, guys. Um, not much of a vlog. I don't know what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna include some stuff from yesterday. I didn't continue vlogging yesterday. Guys, I don't know why I do this to myself. I've just, why have I got a mask on? I've just come back from the shop. Picking up a new desk. A new workspace, we need it. I have no workspace. I do all my editing in my bed or downstairs in the, on the dining table. And I want my own workspace. I want my own little setup. I've had them in the past, never looked after them, never took them seriously. So I've just gone out and bought, why is this so hard? I've just gone out and bought a nice desk to use as my workspace. Okay, we've got some sunlight in. Let me close the door because too much noise going on. Okay, I have my privacy and we have sunlight and we have a new desk. I'm gonna put this up now. I could have to take it down next week. If any of you guys are gonna watch or have you, you've watched the, my latest upload, you'd see that we are moving um, houses or there's a really high chance that we're gonna move in houses. We're just waiting for everything to go through. So I could be taking this down next week. I'm gonna put it up now so I can start working now and have my space now. And if I gotta take a bed down, I gotta take a bed down. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. This is what we're gonna be doing. Ignore the mess around the rest of the room. Please, just, just bear with me. Okay, how do we even start this? How do we even take it out of the box? This is like really heavy, like stupidly heavy. I really should wait to do this for my boyfriend to come home, but I'm too impatient. I need stuff done now. Okay, instructions. Okay. I never go off instructions, but I'm doing it for the sake of this because I actually want it to last. Oh God. The fact that I have to follow instructions is absolutely killing me because I'm crap at following instructions, but I guess I need to. If I want to get this done properly, I guess I need to follow instructions. There's so much concentration on my face. Okay, so the trestles are like 90% done. Guys, I have something common about my floor. Ignore the floor, I'm moving in a couple of weeks. Like, not even a couple of weeks. It's probably gonna be like a week, two weeks time where I've gotta actually go. So, don't, I don't, don't worry about the flooring. I don't care about the flooring. You shouldn't care about the flooring. It doesn't bother me, so don't let it bother you. Simples. I don't hold for the metal right there. But the thing's right there, and like, yeah, that's not gonna work. Like, I've done this wrong, I've done this wrong, I've done this wrong. If you tell me this one's right. These holes, right here, look, they're not there that side. They're not there. This one needs to be flipped around, oh my jeez. I feel like, like this is one of them things that is like hard to follow the instructions but easy to do if you don't follow the instructions. I might just sit here and just appreciate the underneath of the desk for the next hour. Voila! It's always worrying when you have one screw left out of the whole entire packet. And you have no idea where that screw was meant to go. So here's the desk guys. Here's the desk. No, it's not the fanciest, but it does the job. So guys, with this lockdown and everything being complete and utter boring, I can't go out and enjoy myself. I can't go out with my boyfriend and go on a date or anything. So I'm bringing dates to the house. Tonight, I am gonna be cooking a nice steak dinner. I've got them airing in the air for a couple of hours. And for afters, we're gonna be having a chocolate pizza. Mm-hmm, I can't wait, I'm excited. I love cooking, cooking is my favorite. The new house we might be moving to has an awesome kitchen. If anyone ever wants me to cook for you, no problem. I don't mind, guys, I look patchy because I've got tan on. And for anyone who is wondering, no, I have never cooked a chocolate pizza in my entire life. No, have I ever cooked a normal pizza, like homemade in my entire life. You don't know if you don't try. That, that's my motto in life. You don't know unless you, don't, unless you try. And I don't know, and I'm trying, but what's pizza? 
space meant to look like? I don't think it's meant to look like this. Okay, I'm doing something wrong. Okay, I think, I think I've done the pizza base nice. Okay. Ah, uh, sugar. Yeah. Let's not do that. My, my finger went through the dough. I'm enjoying this way too much. I love Nutella. Guys, look. We got the Nutella on the pizza. Not perfect, but it'll do, it'll do. Now we're going to sprinkle on some buttons as if, like, that's going to represent the cheese. And this is going to represent, like, I don't know, pepperonis or whatever. I wish I kind of got, like, bananas or Smarties or something just to, like, put on the top as well. But this is the final piece. We're going to, I'm going to wrap it up and put it away. And then when he comes home while we eat our meal, I'm going to cook this. He has no idea. Ten points, ten points. Ignore the whole house situation, but just look at that river. Look at that lake. It's beautiful. I love it. I love this place. I don't think there's anywhere in the world that can take everything away from me, but be so perfectly put, if that makes sense. Like, I come down here when I'm feeling stressed, or when I'm having anxiety, or when I'm just feeling like I have crap about myself or about life. I come down here and it just all goes away. Just everything just goes away. So I'm gonna walk the dogs. Me, buddy. We're gonna walk the dogs. Um, my mum's already gone up there a bit with some other dogs. Um, so we're gonna walk these dogs and get this walk done and then I gotta go back and edit because I've got a big project I'm working on at the moment. A serious question because this happens to me and if it happens to me, I'm pretty sure it happens to like a load of other people, okay? So this can happen with kids. I've had kids do this to me. I've changed kids' diapers and this has happened. So it's not just dogs I'm gonna reference here. They go for a poo, okay? I don't know where you live, I don't know if it's a law where you live, but where I live it's a law that you have to pick up your dog's poop, okay? So, not a problem, I don't mind, my job, you know, I'm the one who's walking these little four-legged creatures, so I guess I gotta pick up their poop. So, I'm walking along, one of the dogs decide to poop, no problem, I'll stop and I'll wait. I'll go to pick it up, boom, they just wanna fly off, like, they've had their poop and now they're, now they're gone, now, now they're like... I don't know, that now, now they just turn into some wild animal and decide to run off and not wait for their poop to be picked up. So I'm walking along, the dog poops, I've got to pick up the poop, and then it just decides to run off and pull me along with it instead of letting me pick up his poop. Like, come on, come on, dogs. Seriously, two seconds, I wait for you while you have a poop. You can wait two seconds while I pick up your poop. Rant over, I guess. <laughs> Welcome to today's vlog, guys. Um, not much of a vlog. I don't know what I'm going to do today. I'm going to include some stuff from yesterday. I didn't continue vlogging yesterday. I, I just had a little bit of a rough day yesterday. I wasn't feeling myself. I was pretty emotional. Um, so I didn't really pick the camera back up in the evening. But today, today I'm going to make a difference. This sun is so bright. I don't know what I'm going to do today. I've got a load of editing to do. I know that. Um, but for now, I'm out here clearing my head and hoping to just try and de-stress. And I thought I'd bring you guys along with me, bring the camera, start vlogging. You guys have said that you want to start seeing me do some vlogs, get to know me a little bit, get to know who I am as a person. Um, and I, I don't mind. I'm excited for it. I'm excited for the new journeys that life decided to bring and what YouTube is deciding to bring. I don't know how many people on my YouTube channel are, are from Wales, but... Uh, we're pretty much the piss pot of the United Kingdom because it just rains constantly no matter what the season is it'll guarantee be raining honestly like summertime we get about 20 days where it's hot and nice guys there's a duck there's a wild duck where's he gone? where'd the duck go? there it is there he is. I'm gonna make this quick because my phone's gonna die, but do you wanna hear a funny story? Okay, a couple of years ago, this water was purely green, and I mean it was disgusting. By the looks of it, it's been cleaned out a little bit now. But a couple of months ago, I well, a couple of years ago, because sadly the dog who I'm on about has passed away, um, but he jumped in there, and I mean, like, I was standing here, and I said to my mom, I said, imagine if Bob thought that was grass, because it was that green. It generally looked like grass over the water. I said, imagine if Bob was that, that dumb because he was a dumb dog he was a funny dog but he was a dumb dog i'm not gonna lie i loved him a bit though he was my boy he was my he was my bobby brown 
Um, and I said to my mum, I said, imagine if Bob thought that that was grass and just run out and dived on it. Two seconds later, he literally run and dived inside the water. And now it's not, it's not shallow, it's kind of deep. He panicked, he was covered in this green stuff. I felt so bad because I felt like I jinxed him because literally, I, as I said it, he done it. It was, it was crazy. It was a funny experience, but I felt so bad for him. Oh, then Kaz doesn't look happy with us. I think we have some rain coming in, guys. I'm gonna try and get back as quick as I can. When it rains here, it either rains lightly when there's no clouds in the sky or when there's little clouds in the sky or it rains like a friggin' hurricane or something and that's what the clouds are starting to look like and I don't fancy getting soaked. Oh, and we're done. Finally. Just as it's not raining but the wind right now is absolutely ridiculous. So uh, yeah, it's definitely gonna rain sometime today. So thank God I've got all this done early and I'm ready to go early. Now I just gotta go back and edit. All the fun stuff, all the fun stuff. I need to get some food as well. I'm rather hungry right now, to be honest with you. Okay guys, so while I'm waiting for my mum, um, I'm just gonna go on to the topic of why I've been feeling so crap lately. I've just had not had the best of the couple of days. Everything's just gone top of me. I feel like I've rushed everything and the stress that I've put myself through is ridiculous. And I don't need to put myself through stress. I don't need to put myself in this situation. I'm happy, I'm in a happy relationship and I'm in a happy family. You know, I'm doing good, I'm doing happy in everything in life. It's just the stress that I put myself under and I make myself to believe that all these problems are problems when really they're just working out and doing what they have to do to be able to be life, if that makes sense. So if anyone is going through stress, if anyone's going through a stressful time, if anyone's going through a time where you just don't feel yourself and you just feel really down and feel really frustrated with yourself and with life, just be patient, okay? I, I tell everyone this and I'll tell my, I tell myself this on a daily basis. Be patient. Be patient with your job. Be patient with your family. Be patient with your life. Be patient in your relationship. Everything will work out the, the way that it's meant to be. You can't rush things. You can't rush life. You can't rush a job. You can't rush your dreams. Everything will come together. There's no age to be successful. If anyone tells you you're not successful by this age, then your life is over. Don't think it because age is age is just a number. There's no age to success, and I feel like that's definitely a big part in my life. I've always tried to rush everything and tried to be successful early and tried to be successful now. When really, age is just a number, and success doesn't come with age. It comes with patience and pushing yourself to get success. Let's just go chill for the rest of the day and just vlog for the rest of the day. I just wanted to get a little bit of motivation in there into this video. I've had a pretty crap day. If anyone else is having a crap day or having a crap couple of days, I hope this little bit of motivation can push you to do what you have to do. I love you all. I hope those cars come, but do you want to see some dirty water? Look at that water. That is absolutely stinking. And look at it that side. Guys, nice pasty, cheese and ham pasty, and a refreshing Rio tropical drink while I edit. Guys, I really wish I could show you how excited I was I am for this video to get uploaded. I know for a fact that you guys are going to enjoy it. If you're a real supporter, you're going to enjoy, ignore the boxes, we're in the middle of moving. You're going to enjoy what you're going to see. Let me, let me show you a preview. Watch this screen right here. Ooh, look, I can't wait, I can't wait. Oh. Give me like one more day and it will be uploaded. I can't wait. I, I cannot wait. You guys probably don't even like, won't even like it, but I just can't wait to see it done and just see the inspiration and the moving and I don't know, the change in everything and how far I've actually come. Guys, about like 20 minutes on, I'm still added in. Hang on. Ugh. Guys, it's finally red. red. Get me words out. Guys, it's finally rendering. I cannot uh, I cannot wait to see you guys. Well, I cannot wait to show you guys to get why can't I get my words out? I can't wait for you guys to see this video. It's insane. It's it's a it's just wait and see. Just wait and see. It's gonna be a good video. You guys should enjoy it. I hope you enjoy it. Um I just can't wait to let everyone know this news that I've been holding in and trying to keep quiet for so long. But I'm ready for you guys to see this. Right. You know it comes to something when it's like eight o'clock at night and you're both sitting in the car eating a McDonald's instead of eating it in your house. Mm-hmm. Feels more special. Yeah. Date night. <laughs> Date night in the car. <laughs> I'm good.
Good morning guys. Oh my god, I look terrible. I'd never put anything like this on YouTube if I wasn't going to end the video. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this little vlog. I'm not sure what it includes. It includes the last couple of days. I've tried to vlog as much as I can. I'm trying to get used to just being in front of the camera, just getting on with my day to day life. It's hard. Um, it's hard to do when you're not used to it. Today I am not feeling too good. I'm in pain. I suffer with endometriosis and I am in a lot of pain right now. So I'm waiting for the doctors to call so I can get some painkillers and I don't think I'm going to be recording today because of the amount of pain I'm in. So I'm in. So I'm on an editing day today. Um, I've just uploaded a corn reaction to my Patreon. I did try to upload it to f onto YouTube but unfortunately because of the copyright situation I couldn't continue to upload it and, and it wouldn't go up to YouTube. It, it just kept saying blocks even when I deleted some bits. So I've uploaded it to my Patreon. If you guys do want to go over and see it then my Patreon my Patreon link is in the description guys. I'm so sorry. As I said I, I Stuff like that, like corn reactions, that was planned to go into YouTube, but obviously things fail and I couldn't get that up on there. So that it's gone to my Patreon. If you guys do want to follow it, go over and check my Patreon. If you guys don't, no problem. There's no pressure at that, at that one at all. So let me not, let me guys let me know what you guys think of this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Bye guys.